Hello, um, I'm going to be doing a case presentation on scabies. So you are an advanced practice registered nurse at a primary care practice and you are seeing SC, a one-year-old boy presenting with a rash and itching. He has no past medical or surgical history. He has no known allergies. His mother states that last week she picked him up from daycare and she noticed the start of a rash all over his arms, legs, and belly. She said the rash has been spreading. He's been itching it constantly and has been increasingly more fussy the past couple days. On exam, his vital signs were completely stable. He was afebrile, his heart rate was 110, his blood pressure was 82 over 60, and his respiratory rate was 24. His oxygen saturation was 100% and he did not appear to be in any respiratory distress. His lung, heart, and abdominal sounds were all normal. He did appear quite fussy, but he was consoled easily by his mum. The rash was spread throughout his bilateral upper and lower extremities, mostly inside the elbows, under his armpits, and behind the knees, as well as his torso and his scalp. The rash consists of very small, light brown lines with mild erythema and inflammation to those areas. Your likely diagnosis for SC is scabies, as he has the characteristic burrows associated with scabies mites. You decide to take a small scraping of the skin to observe under the microscope for confirmation of this diagnosis. However, you start the patient on the topical treatment for scabies, which is Lindane, an antiparasitic medication. You also discuss several home remedies while the medication kills the mites. You tell SC's mom that taking an antihistamine if the itching persists may help relieve some of the itching her son is experiencing. You also suggest that using calamine lotion, soaking in cool water, or taking an oatmeal bath might help. Um, you discuss with Estee's mom that he has likely acquired scabies through close contact at daycare since this is a common pattern of spread, but not to worry, the medication will be applied um, and will rapidly kill the mites using, cut, that are causing this infection. Um, below are my two references for this. Thank you very much for listening.